Legal medical marijuana grow sites popping up all over Medford. Neighbors now asking police for help in regulating the high numbers. It's all over the county. It's in every neighborhood. It's in uh, urban neighborhoods and rural. It's, uh, I found it in commercial sites. Legal marijuana grows for medical marijuana patients covering Medford. Madge officers say the grow sites are easy to see and smell. And the odor really gives it away. You know, we have a lot of complaints in the fall, especially about the odor um, impacting their ability to even utilize their backyards. You know, people that have lived in places for years and years and not being able to use it because of the odor. They also say they're receiving a high number of complaints from neighbors so far this year. We're seeing more complaints this year than we've probably seen in the past, especially early on. Aside from the smell, Madge officers say the grows can cause fires, causing some neighbors to feel uneasy. We've had some fires that have been related to faulty wiring. And the complaints don't end there. Not to mention, though, some of the other issues that we're seeing um, include um, just, uh, you know, neighbors feeling intimidated. Lieutenant Johnson says if you think there's an illegal grow site near you, contact police. We asked our News and Facebook friends what they would change about marijuana garden regulations if they could. Mel says if she could change the laws, she would have the gardens outside of city limits. Chrissy likes the idea of having one piece of land for growers to share, like a community garden. Lori doesn't see how medical marijuana gardens are different from other gardens. And Susan thinks neighborhood grows should be legal. She says people who need medical marijuana have to leap over too many hurdles already.